Hey everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to know if Ripple is a good investment. Let's get right into it. Ripple is a payment protocol that processes international money transfers using blockchain technology. It has partnered with hundreds of financial institutions that use its technology and offer low transaction fees and extremely fast processing times. Ripple is frequently misunderstood as a cryptocurrency. Ripple is not a cryptocurrency in and of itself, but it does have a native cryptocurrency called XRP. Those who like Ripple and want to invest in it can do so by purchasing XRP. Ripple has potential, but it has also had some high-profile issues. Most notably, the Securities and Exchange Commission of the United States filed a lawsuit against it at the end of 2020. Software developer Ryan Fugger came up with the first version of Ripple when he founded Ripple Pay in 2004. People could use the site to give credit to others in their community. Ripple is thus the rare crypto project that existed in some form prior to Bitcoin, if somewhat not as a cryptocurrency at the time. Ripple was mentioned in an email by Bitcoin's anonymous creator, Satoshi Nakamoto, who used the pseudonym Satoshi Nakamoto. Jed McCaleb, a programmer, began working on the XRP cryptocurrency and blockchain in 2011. In 2012, he assembled a team, found investors, and approached Fugger about using his RipplePay network. Fugger agreed to relinquish control of RipplePay. In 2012, they launched their company and the XRP cryptocurrency. The original was known as NewCoin before being renamed OpenCoin and then Ripple. Ripple would later form alliances with financial institutions. In 2019, it announced that its RippleNet payment network was used by over 300 financial institutions in over 45 countries. If you're debating whether this cryptocurrency is a good investment, Ripple's early success is a plus. The SEC filed a lawsuit against Ripple on December 22, 2020 for selling $1.3 billion in unregistered securities through its XRP cryptocurrency. Ripple has responded by claiming that XRP is not a security. RippleNet's mission is to provide banks with fast, cheap, and convenient cross-border transactions. As a result, it is an alternative to SWIFT, the current international payment system used by the majority of banks. Ripple provides several benefits for international transactions. To begin, the average transaction takes 5 seconds to complete. Secondly, even at the token's all-time high price, the transaction fee is 1 100,000th XRP, which is less than a fraction of a cent. Finally, the XRP cryptocurrency can function as a bridge currency. This allows financial institutions to trade currencies at a lower cost. They can hold XRP instead of various fiat currencies. To verify transactions, the XRP cryptocurrency employs a consensus protocol. Validators check proposed transactions against the most recent version of the XRP ledger and accept valid transactions. A transaction must be accepted by the majority of validators in order to be verified. Another thing to note is that, unlike Bitcoin, XRP is not a mineable cryptocurrency. Instead, Ripple created every single one of the 100 billion Ripple coins that have ever existed, or will ever exist, and there were 49.38 billion XRP in circulation as of August 18, 2012. However, as of this time, the total supply of XRP has been burned and removed from the market. Ripple has stated that it does not burn its own coins, but Garlinghouse stated in 2021 that he would not rule out doing so in order to maintain or even increase the price at some point. Furthermore, Ripple CTO David Schwarz stated that there is nothing preventing XRP holders from burning their coins. Users rather than the company behind the coin are likely to have been burning a limited amount of Ripple. Nonetheless, when compared to the likes of Bitcoin, XRP has a relatively large number of coins in circulation. This has the unintended consequence of ensuring that Ripple will never reach the price levels of cryptos such as Bitcoin or Ethereum. On the other hand, this does not preclude XRP from rising significantly in relative terms. In theory, you could make a significant profit on Ripple without the coin itself being worth that much. The Ripple coin's main blockchain is known as the XRP ledger. It is intended to allow users to send transactions to the network for review. As previously stated, there is no mining with XRP, so there is some debate as to whether it can be considered a true blockchain. To be considered valid, a transaction must be approved by computers or nodes on the network. 
known as unique nodes, which have a list of approved unique nodes, giving them the authority to approve transactions. Having an approved list, at least in theory, allows transactions to happen faster, making things far more convenient for system users. The most important thing to remember about XRP is that its future price is heavily dependent on whether a U.S. court agrees with the SEC on claims that it is an unregistered security. The court case has been an issue for a long time and it has ultimately kept Ripple's price down as potential investors prefer something with a lower risk of imposed failure. Now, is XRP Crypto a good investment now as it is down 50% in 2022 and has lost 30% in the past month? There is good news in Ripple, but experts consider the bad news to be more important. Therefore, they do not think XRP at just under 40 cents has bottomed, nor that it is a buy. That's it for today. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on that notification bell so you never miss out on any future content we'll produce for you guys. We're signing off now, but we will be sure to catch you all in the next one.